To another video we got a product review this is one that i reached out to and i was like hey i want to try your product and they sent me some what is it you asked the magic spoon what what could the magic spoon be is it a spoon that produces food straight out of the spoon i don't know uh am i giving you my address no i'm not okay good so magic spoon well here i'm gonna get inside and i'm gonna i'm gonna show you what what they're all about let me first well i know the box says yeah oh it gives it away right here Say healthy cereal that doesn't taste like the box. That's important. So it, it's giving you a way that it's cereal. Oh yes. What's inside you might ask? I'm getting too ahead of myself. No, I'm not. I'm gonna read all of these after. Oh yes. So there's four boxes in here. All different colors. I only brought three, three bowls though. So I might have to do something different with that. High protein, keto friendly, non-GMO, gluten-free, grain-free, soy-free, wheat-free, nothing artificial, childlike cereals for grown-ups. That's what these are. We got a cocoa flavored, frosted cereal, fruity cereal, and cinnamon cereal. Let's move that. Here's my little army, making a wall out of cereal. They never, they never claim to be great at standing up. That's not like part of All right, I'm gonna get into this. Let me get a... Uh... I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start with what I think would be the worst. Well, not the worst. Okay, I, I'm, all of these sound great. I'm gonna go with which one I think I would like least. I think that would be the frosted one. No, nah, maybe the fruity one. We're gonna try the fruity one. I'm gonna put, okay. We're diving in. I am gonna be opening all of them on this video, so. Oh, look at that. Look at that color. Are you seeing this? They look like pink Fruit Loops. Just a bunch of pink Fruit Loops. Let's try it without milk first. That's really weird. 12 grams of protein in a 3 fourths cup serving. Uh, it tastes like there's like powder, or not powder sugar, crystal sugar, like the ones that go on like decorative cakes and stuff. It's good. It just tastes like strawberry. It doesn't taste like fruity. It just tastes like just strawberry, but I like it. I'm gonna move on though, I'll finish it. Don't worry, it's not going to waste. I'll be, I'll be finishing everything. Fear not, little ones. I also realize the way that I open that makes it harder to save. Let's go with cinnamon. No, let's go with frosted, that's the one that I was saying. It'll probably be next least favorite. I'm gonna judge it based on the fruity one. These are, these are really good, but I'm like confused. I think I like this one better right now. The sweetener is allulose which I'm gonna look and see if that's good. Allulose is a low energy monosaccharide sugar present, uh, present in small quantities in natural product, first identified in wheat more than 70 years ago. It's keto though, keto sugar. Interesting, this is good. Oh, it literally says on this, our magic. Allulose is a rare sugar found in raisins, figs, and maple syrup. Contains only 10% of the calories of regular sugar and is not metabolized in your body, so it does not affect blood sugar levels, all while having the same familiar taste and texture as regular sugar. That's what's so interesting about this. Cinnamon. So this one looks like wheat cherry. Just smells like cinnamon. Wow. I'm overall, I'm already genuinely impressed with this cereal. If it's as healthy as it's saying it is, then we're onto something. Manufactured in Brooklyn, New York. Mmm. These are all so good. It's a very strong cinnamony flavor. Tastes a little like uh tastes like mmm. What's it called? Cinnamon toast crunch with like a different sweetener. The sweetener is definitely what makes it different. Let me just tell you. I think the frosted one might be my favorite right now. So I'm gonna put it like this. Would this be in the first, second, third? Oh, wait. So frosted, then cinnamon, and then the fruity one. Okay, slap, I'm about to. I only have three bowls. So I'm gonna finish off this one really fast. You can uh, enjoy watching me eat for a second because I gotta finish this off to get the, the chocolatey one. Ow. Have fun. Hope you're enjoying this. Don't mind me eating. If you put this in, that's okay too. Or not. This probably, I don't know. Okay, now I'm gonna resume. Okay, now, I just took a second and I finished off the first one that I tried. I've tried, the, I finished up that fruit one. It got better, by the way. It only gets better. Um, but I had to free up a bowl because I only had three bowls. I freed up a bowl to try the chocolatey one, which I have very high hopes for. So, 
Don't let me down, Coco. Let's see. Oh, it smells really good. They're all these little loops. They all look like Cheerios. Much more subtle than the other ones. It tastes a lot like Cocoa Puffs if you made them dark chocolate. That's impressive. I'm, I'm impressed with this brand. I'm gonna put that one as my favorite. So here is your, here's your lineup. If you're gonna get Magic Spoon stuff, I recommend the chocolate most. On it, they're all delicious. If you're a fruity, fruity person, maybe you like fruity. If you're a cinnamon person, maybe you like cinnamon, frosted, chocolate. I recommend them all. This is just my personal favorite. Thank you, uh, Magic Spoon, for sending me these. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, review. And if you're watching this, uh, go and check them out. Magic Spoon, they have an Instagram. I'm gonna link them down below. They've got a website. I'm gonna link them down below. You can go and buy your own, try it for yourself. Hopefully you have four bowls so you can try them all and not have to revive a bowl. But that's all I got. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to comment. Oh, don't forget to comment, favorite, share, like, subscribe, do it all be legit. Hope you enjoyed this. Go and buy some Magic Spoon cereal. And yeah, that's this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Just so nice on you. Peace out. Hey.